Welcome back to Made in Papa's Woodshop. On this is part two of the Dust Will Make You Sick series. And today we're going to be unboxing the two items that I've gotten. One is the Air Gear Pro to put over my face to keep the dust out. And the other one is this um, Ken Brown 12 inch exhaust fan. And uh, it's going to suck. It has the potential to pull all of the air out of my wood shop every minute. This then will be used in conjunction with it to keep any remaining particulate filtered out and out of my lungs. So let's take a look at what's in this box. All right, we have a protective eyewear that is designed to work with my glasses. My glasses are fitted in there. You have the center of the respirator piece. Let's see, this one. So this will go up over my head. And this will snap around behind my neck. Has a bag, which I make a habit of keeping it in there when dust is still flying around. It has, let's see, these are the two filter pieces, one on each side. Here are the two filter caps, one on each side. And then there is a package of these filters to put one on each side. And now I'm gonna to try to put it together. Let's check and see which way it goes. Should it be with the print out or the print in? According to this picture, it's print out. One of the tabs is much smaller than the other, so it has to fit in a very specific spot. The smallest tab goes in the smallest, and then you can rotate it. There we go. Let's put this on. Okay, nose in first.
smells new. But that smell, there. it's got to go too. Woo! It's just a new smell. All right, so this is the Air Gear Pro. And these are N95 filters. And the idea is to use this, this pretty durable silicon feeling seal here. Rubber, I'm not sure what that is, but it's very flexible and it smashes up against my face nicely and makes a nice seal. So, so far, I like them. Okay, now this one feels a little goofy. It feels weird to put something on over my glasses, but here goes. Wow. Okay. My glasses fit in there just fine. This feels creepy being this close. Uh. Now this next item is the Ken Brown 12 inch exhaust shutter fan. One of the features I thought was really cool to see how well it works is that it says Y'all oh, pardon my voice, I'm sure I sound like somebody else. While this is healing, I sound just goofy. But it says that the gravity pulls the black stick. Do you have a guy here? Yeah, you have the adjustable speed switch. See what else is in there. Okay, it's got the white and black. We? Oh. They gave us some red wire nuts and some screws. Some installation instructions. Alright. That looks pretty cool. It's 12 inches by 12 inches. And I'm gonna cut a square in the wool. And the place that I found to cut it, there's no two by four. So I don't have to do a support piece. And I can literally screw in two sides. Wait a minute, I might be able to screw all four of these in. If I cut it in such a way that just this slips through and goes to the outside, then from the inside, I can put screws in all the way around and it should stay put, seal pretty tight. And the idea is that, ooh, I got it upside down. So that when it kicks on, these guys come up and when it kicks off, they fall back down. And again, it's supposed to pull out 1800 cubic feet and my shunk is only 11 by 11 by 11. So I suspect if it does what I hope it does, that it's going to pull all the air out of my shop, maybe every minute. I'm pretty excited about this. So there you go for the unboxing. Thank you for joining us here on Made in Papa's Wood Shop Part 2. And of dust will make you sick. It certainly did me. Learned the hard way and I'm passing this info on to help you guys out. And uh, <clears throat> Part 3 will be the installation.